this is my favorite scenes from the Unus Anus YouTube channel. So here we go. Anus, Unus, Anus. We live our lives taking each second for granted. But what would you do if you knew how much time you had left? Unus Anus. Much like all of you, has a limited amount of time. And every day, we march ever closer to this channel's inevitable doom. That means we'll be uploading every single day until the clock strikes zero. And then, it's game over. Bye-bye. Finito. Finished. Curtains. Gone, gone. Night-night. Dead. Forever. Make no mistake, this doesn't mean that we'll just stop uploading. When time runs out, we will be deleting this channel and every single video on it. And you'll never be able to see them again. Because much like death, you can't take it with you. And all we'll have is the memories that we make along the way. And the merch. So the clock starts now. But the choice is yours. Will you join us? Or will you miss out on your one chance to be a part of Unis Honest? Because time is already running out. The train is already moving. So subscribe now, because death is coming. Ask not for whom the bell tolls. Ring the bell for thyself to know. For there are no second chances. And if you miss out, all you'll be left with is regret. Memento mori. We'll see you tomorrow. Unis Honest. I knew a good bunch of folks when I seen them. Thank you for being an Unis. The superior side of Unis Honest. What defines us? What makes us so much better? Well, our kind heart, our compassion, our driven nature. When we feel the lowest of our low, we rise up to the tip, tip top, not letting anyone or anything get in our way. You're eccentric, the life of the party. You can tell when people are feeling down and you try your best to bring them back up with you. You're creative and your heart, you wear it right on your sleeve. You're not afraid to show emotion when it needs to be showed. And you're definitely not afraid of the dark. Now, if you truly are an Unis, then obviously this video will have way, way, way more views. I suspect that our audience is mostly Unises, as we are better in every way. Now, how are we better than an Honest? Well, it's simple. That is filled to the brim with an Honest is just not here with an Unis. We know when to take a step back and let somebody else have the spotlight for just a second. Honest is... Oh, so bold, so brash, but in the worst of ways. Always flaunting about with their big muscles out, showing off to the world. Hey, cover up. You don't need to show off so much. Let somebody else in. Thanks. Now, if you happen to be out in the wild and unfortunately spot and honest, this is what you should do. Ah, oh, get a load of... Th them No shoes, no shirt, no service. Read the sign. You've done it. You made the right choice. You are an honest after all. If you were an unis, you wouldn't be able to watch. You couldn't bear the burden. You couldn't take the strain. Let's face it. Unises are meek. They may think they're compassionate, but they're passive and passive aggressive. Meanwhile, honestes speak from the heart. They speak their truth. They let people know how they feel, and they don't let anyone walk over them, ever. <laughs> Thank you for being who you are and supporting me, the original honest. The template for which you were cast. Some people think that the mold is broken, but no. I kept it around, and you fit right in. It's so fantastic to be an honest. To have this amount of confidence inside of your soul. 
to know exactly where you're going and how you're going to get there. The defining traits of an honest boldness, brashness, confidence. Two B's, one C, makes an A. That's what you are. You're indefinable, but you're totally rock solid when it comes to you and what you know and your future. The utmost certainty is success. And if this video gets more views than the other video, then we will officially declare Honest as the superior half to Unis. Honest. Now and forever. You don't need to do anything. Simply by being here, you've shown the world that Honest are the superior choice. It's who you are. It's who you are always meant to be. And you definitely weren't meant to be no cowardly ass. Now you're probably wondering what you should do when you are to encounter an Unis in the wild. And I'm here to give you some helpful tips. Whoa! <laughs> this kind of person. Pathetic. Everything about this does not represent what an Honest truly is about. You should be ashamed of who you are and what you've done. Can't believe that I'm even within arm's reach of you. Man, I don't know if I should do this thing. What do you think, inner conscience? What? Oh, I could. Wow, that's... I've never thought of that before. Oh, but that is true. Hmm. Well, I'm in a pickle. Wow. Streaming capable and boy howdy are they. Make sure it twitch. Facebook, my dude. Why not? <laughs> <laughs> All right, get in your hair. What color are your eyes? Hazel. I don't know, like greenish, bluish. Whatever, whatever, whatever. It's fine. It's fine. I'm starting to sweat. Well, maybe you should work out more. Uh -huh. die naked. I'm not like a nudist. This is really like 
sounds like a recruitment slogan for nudism, but I'm not a nudist. I'm just, you know, comfortable in my own skin. My beautiful skin. Have you ever, have you ever gone to a naked Korean bathhouse? Me? Yeah. No, I haven't. Way spa. You're in LA. Yeah, I should go. We should go. We should go. What Let's we go. Let's get massages. Let's do it. You free tonight? Oh, uh, unfortunately, I don't think I am. Oh. Yeah, I don't think I am. Hi, tomorrow. Oh, no, wait, I'm busy tomorrow. Uh, yeah, you're busy? Yeah. You have any stories about being naked in front of people? I haven't been naked in front of that many people. Oh. Who have I even been naked in front of? No one. Not a single person. So you're the first person to see me naked, Mark. Awesome. How's it feel? I mean, underwhelming, but... How does it make you feel? Underwhelmed. What about, like, your parents? Oh, they've never seen it. <laughs> what? Out the womb full of dress. I was. Sweater vest. Wow. Oh, I was keeping it classy even back then. I've never seen you in a sweater vest. Yeah, well, it's because it's my birth clothes. You only wear those on your birthday. That's right. right. That's why they call it a birthday suit. This is coming out great. I hope you've captured my likeness properly. I really think I did. Getting every crevasse. Oh, man, I didn't get your crevasses. There's a lot of scribbling going on. I don't have that much body hair, so... I'm assuming it's contouring and uh, shading. Mm -hmm. He's using a crosshatch method. I hope that everyone at home, once they watch this, do their own studies of our forms. We want to see, see all of your anatomical analyses. Oh, you done? I think I think I've captured your ways. Good, 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 good. In fact, good. What uh, what are we dealing with? This is what we're dealing with. I think it looks great. What's the first word that came to mind when I flipped this around? It was gnome. <laughs> What really, what really jumps out at you? The smiley face from the nipples to the grundle. <laughs> what they've created. A nice unis honest poop. Unis honest poop. Oh, they're an honest. Oh, get a load of th them. No shoes, no shoes, <laughs> no service. <laughs> Read the sign. <laughs> Do we have wonderful, eggs at home? Wonderful tracking. <laughs> Honey, what's that over there? <laughs> Honey, well, I've never heard of one of those. Delicious. take either. Yeah? Yeah, take a Green Giant sponsorship. This right here is my favorite thing. Hey. In the history of forever. Mm. I think about this every day. You're so sweet. I think sweet. about this all night long. Mm. I stay all night? awake, not mm. sleeping, because I'm thinking about this. Mark, mm. you should have told me. I've been right here the whole time. Mm. Do you, is this what you look like every time you think about me? Hmm? Here, I'm going to think about you real quick. I'm going to think about you. Okay, I'll pull up the next link and you think about me, okay? Okay. You ready to not think yeah, about me I'm anymore? Done. Yeah, I'm done. Yeah. Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah, the boys at 2 a.m. looking oh, for beans. No. They're getting closer. Oh, <laughs> God! No, they're going to get me! God, you're big. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, look big, at me. Big boy. Big Ethan. <laughs> big Ethan. <laughs> oh, look at that dog. Wow, that was good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. What? what the hell? Get the kids out. Grab the bags. And get another car. I'll be there in 20 minutes. You cannot hesitate. I love you. <laughs> Holy shit. What the fuck? We're getting closer. Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs>
Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Chica, come here. Chica, it's me. Chica, come here. Come over here. I love you, dog. We got it out. Now just see if it'll fit in the car. This is not going to fit in the car. <laughs> Right? Uh-huh. And I said, hey, I just called over the phone. I have a large inner tube in my car. Can you blow it up? And he said, how big? And I said, this big. And he said, okay. And then they finally blowed it up. And I said, wow, this is so great. And they ran back to the car and I opened up the trunk. And I had to <laughs> You know what? You know what? That's that's it's horrible. Here, get stand up. I'm gonna get on my knees for you. <laughs> All right, listen. You're a bit. Who's a big boy? I am. Who's a big brave boy? Wow. Who's a big boy? <laughs> I'm about to be. Ready? Three. What are we doing? Running into each other. I'm afraid. Three, two, one. <laughs> See, easy. Let's try it again. Okay, you know, that's the jump before impact. Oh, yeah. Oh, God. You ready for full speed? Far. I'm going for it. Okay. Three, two, Mama. one. <laughs> Consistency. Ah! Why are you hitting me in the spine? I'm sorry. That's twice now. Are you okay? Oh, I'm fine. Okay. Yeah, I'd say overall pretty good. It wouldn't be my first choice. Now I could go into the moral quandary of what the, the meat industry and all that stuff, but I'm I'm looking at this from purely a perspective of like whether or not it's something that you could eat or should eat. Um Feels so horrible. Don't shoot my ass. <laughs> you told me not to aim for your spine. So why did you aim for my ass? Where else will I go? Don't direct hit my spine. It's like 10% of my back. <laughs> I have a whole back. 
terms of price, it's definitely was more expensive. Um, it was about six twenty nine. Uh, I think that. I don't even know where that hit you. That shoulder. Hamburger. 저는 햄버거를 좋아해요. Uh, necesito uh, dinero uh, grande para uh, impossible whopper. Gracias for watching. <laughs> Remember to subscribe. Time is always ticking. And you never know when it's going to run out. Check this out at your local Burger King, and thanks for watching. What's the name of the channel? Oh, I don't know. I, uh, for some reason, I can't remember it anymore. What's the name of the channel, Mark? You got to say it. Well, we never say it at the end. What are you Sometimes about? we do. That's not. That's not what we usually do. Sometimes we do. One year. What is it in Latin? <laughs> I don't know Latin, <laughs> you silly man. I, I don't. If you don't say it, I'm going to shoot you for being dumb. <clears throat> All right, fine. You pussy, it's doing is honest. Ah! Ah, get up there! I'm no! I'm shoot you, get no! the fuck up there! No! Get up there! No, that wasn't the deal! You have to know how it feels. That wasn't the deal! I'm dead serious, you have to know how this feels. There was no deal! You have to know one. I took ten shots. Oh, you have that to know wasn't what part one's of the deal. like. You have to know what one is like. You shot me twice at the end there. Oh. Get your sorry oh, ass up against that I wall. Don't think I have you to. big pussy. I didn't sign up for this. You shot me twice. How close? Same distance. Mark, I've never been shot with a paintball. Yeah, and you were shooting me. Mark! Do you want to see what the words were? I could have been so much harder on you. What were the words? Fast food. Real. Uh, yeah, there was the uh, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> yeah, of course. Yeah. <laughs> Grunting noise. <laughs> I, I could have been so much harder. Why didn't you? There you go. So much See, fun. so the two really made up for what I could have done. Get up against the wall. Mark! One shot. I don't want this. is a brand new hoodie. This is brand new. Take it off. Do it, Bear. I have the Unis on his t-shirt. I said Bear skin. No! Okay, fine, fine. You don't have to do it. I'm not going to do it. But I, I get one in the future. I get one. If you don't take it now, I get to shoot you with a paintball at some point in the future. You won't know when. You won't know where. I will shoot you. Oh, my God. You might have a lot of clothes on. You might have a little. Oh no. So you either take one now or I get a free pass for the rest of the year. Deal? Just one shot. Oh, why did I make this I don't know, but it's this on is, camera. This is so much worse <laughs> know, than right? getting shot right now. Know, right? <sighs> Chica is homeless. She don't have a roof over her head. I also know my way around wood. Different. Why? Give us a little belt tour. All right, Come all on. right, a belt tour? Yeah, okay. belt tour. Here, let me, me spin tour. for you. Do, 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 it's my belt tour. Hey, I've got a hammer. Do, do, hey, I've got a crescent wrench. <laughs> is that what, the, what is this? It's not a crescent wrench. Keep going. I've got safety goggles for when we saw some wood. Ooh, safe. We've got a tape measure. Do, 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 I'm this long. Okay, what else do I have? I've got a box cutter. Do, 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 do. Put it back in and be safe. What else do I have? A chisel? Do, 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 do. Da, da, da. Do, do, do. I've got a level. Oh, hey, that level. <laughs> I've also got some pliers. Needle nose and normal. <laughs> and that's all the tools I've got. All right, cool. That's good. Well, you give me your tool. I'll give a tool tour. <laughs> I've got a pencil. So you know where to cut. Do you have a pencil? Okay, I also want to say, just for my own thing, mm -hmm. that you went to Home Depot and got stuff specifically for this. I... I asked if you needed anything. 
you got me there. <laughs> so uh, I've got nails. I thought that was like a communal tool. I can lend you some nails. All right. You want some Is there nails? an interest rate or anything? I've got a square. Ooh, love a good square. It is a level. Uh, it's also magnetic. It's got a ruler on it, and it's got also a uh, 45 degree angle. Uh, I've got my uh, my box cutter here. I got my rubber mallet for the chisel. I got my 20 ounce for nails, claw hammer specifically, and then one of the most important tools in any woodworker's kit is a chalk line. A what? Chalk line. Chalk line. Chalk line. Chalk line. Chalk line. Chalk line. Chompeth. What does it do? It's a chalk line. Like this? <laughs> so this is what oh, a chalk God. line would be for. This line is full of chalk, right? You would have measured something, but you go, and then you've got a line. <laughs> Not anymore. Uh. <laughs> so we're not going to use that line, by the way. Oh, God, I'm bloody Should we go? Because We've last, done our last, tool. Last tool. I didn't finish my... You got a little baby measly, uh, measly they measure. A big, thick... Thick, thick measure. I think this is funny. <laughs> <laughs> and I got a little one. Just for things that don't need to be 35 feet long. So, what are we doing today? We're building a doghouse for Chica. We are. And we're doing it all by hand. We're doing it all by hand and also, with a lot of things, we do it for bits and goofs and gaps. We're actually going to try. Yes. Build a doghouse. We're going to try. And uh, we're we're going to just, like, use mm -hmm. basic woodworking principles mm -hmm. here. We're not going to do any fancy joints or anything like that. And we don't need to. Yeah. Just needs quick and dirty. Also, although we are not using power tools, we are still using saws. Make sure if you're using tools, be very, very safe. That's safe. why we're not messing around, because you can get seriously, seriously hurt. Tools are not toys. You gotta treat them with respect, and you gotta you gotta use them like they're supposed to be. It's not a goof. If you no misuse tools, I will kill you. So, th what saw are we using? I think. We Which should saw should we use? This boy. Other Why? <laughs> I don't know. Did you get a good grip on it? <laughs> that is a hacksaw. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Just a normal trade cut. Trade cut is the name of the brand. <laughs> Does it say on it? 380 millimeters. It's 380 millimeters wide? <laughs> yeah, dude, obviously. <laughs> you can generally count on a saw being 1 16th. Okay. So, you know, so it won't be exactly. You're going to, but is it paramount that it needs to be that length? When you put the boards here, are yeah. you laying them on the inside of the lip or the outside of the lip of this plank? True. <laughs> No, no, dude, just make a small mark first. Oh, yeah, that's true. <laughs> and then pick up the square. <laughs> Put the square down. <laughs> All right, so cut a, we'll cut a little bit to the left. A little bit to the left. Okay, I trust you. Here it... What? What? <laughs> <laughs> Try to like lift as you push. You know what? Actually, Are we sure it's a push saw. I'm pretty sure, but you know, it go. It, maybe it's it's both. It's both ways. Universal cut. 
There Does you that go. Mean anything? That's good. Then it, you can go. It cuts both ways. So, but you should technically be able to push it. Push it hey, here, hard. hold on. Try it and try and push it. Okay. It okay. seems hard. Okay. Wait, I want the satisfaction. Okay. Ooh, sorry, that was my bad. That was my mistake. That you could have done this. I, yeah. <laughs> this is an engineer's work. No. The engineers made these. <laughs> well, yes, but... They engineered it. Ingenuity. Yeah. yeah. Can we get the cut? <laughs> sure. If I could just figure out... <laughs> just cut three and a quarter off of both of them. Three and a quarter. And a quarter. Mm-hmm. That was oh, good. actually, I forgot something. I'll be right back. I'm going to cut this wood. How are you doing? I'm cutting. Okay, good. Hey! You got it. Mama, I'm learning! You're learning! I'm a real man's man! Ethan? Get on your knees. Why? I'm ten feet away. You have safety glasses and we're outside. Mark... Today's the day. Mark. Today's the day. Will you back up a little bit further? No, 10 feet. That was the exact, and I just measured from where you are to where I am is 10 feet. Okay, but hold on. Uh -huh. With that paintball gun, mm -hmm. we've, we know that it's more powerful. We don't know. We do know. How? Because you tested it, and it was so much more powerful. In what way? Because it was so much louder. So what do you want? Another two feet? I don't know what I want. You don't know what you want? I don't know what I want. Listen, life comes at us fast. We don't know what life is going to give us. And today, it's going to give you a paintball. We don't know how fast that one shoots. It shoots this fast. Will you take a couple more steps back? How about you go to where that was? Right there. Okay. Does that sound fair? Okay. But you Can will I have a tip? What? Should I tense? Or should I let my body loose? I don't think it matters. Dude, I'm freaking out right now. It's fine, man. Look. I'll shoot, the, shoot the thing again. What I'll do you power mean? Power. You just saw. That's so powerful. Do you want me to get the other gun? Because the only it's... thing is you know what that one felt like. True. True. All right. You know what? That's fair. I'll go look for it. You 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 think about it. You you think about what's about to happen. I'm fucking freaking out, dude. It's not okay. I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this at all. All right. Got this. I also found this for you for your ears. Just in case I'm off target. Wait. Wait, where did it go? It bounced. Oh, wait. Hit it again. So it is slower. Okay. I don't know if that's better or worse. Well, if it doesn't break, it's bad. It'll hurt worse. Great. Get over there. <laughs> okay, oh, you on. won't you won't shoot me until I'm over there, right? No! I'll shoot you right here if you don't go. That's okay. my promise. Okay. That's fine. Why are you standing over there? I don't know. Just do it. Get on your knees. No. Why not? Just do it. Are you sure? Yeah. Well, are you a proper distance away? I am. You ready? Uh-huh. Okay, it's gonna happen. Yep. Ah. Let's take a bigger swim. <laughs> the worst. Ah. Oh. It's not as bad as I thought. See? Oh my god, that really stings though. Yeah. <laughs> And it's over. It's over. It's over. That's not as bad as I thought. See? It's so much less worse than I thought. You big baby. It stings a lot, but it's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. Yeah. What did you do? I don't know what's happening, dude. All right. You want to go again? No, no. You got it. Let's cool. take a speed, you know. Well, it's, uh, it's a frame. Well, don't forget we, your hammer. <laughs> what do we do now? Now we got to attach the walls, figure out if the walls are going to go to the inside. we got to figure out if we're going to do corner posts. we got to figure out how this bad boy is going to get together. This is a longer process than I thought. That's why I was saying it was going to take a bit. It's actually not that long of a process. It just happens to be taking us a bit longer. I think it's good. We'll make a dog bed instead of a dog frame. House? The house. So now what we do, we take this off, we put it on top, we put the wood on top, and then we put the hammers in, the nails in uh, like this under here, and then it's all stuck together. 
right? Technically, yes. And technically, yes is the best kind of yes. All right. You gonna be good? To get this? Yeah. Neighbors love it. <laughs> Oops. I goofed it. You beat me. You did it. Student becomes a master, you know. You're a real nice. man now. Yeah. All right. You have a hammer holder in your belt. Flip her over. That's pretty nice. Uh, hey, you sand this down. Perfect. All right, done. Good sand. Yeah, good sand. Oh. This will be the comfiest <laughs> this bed. This looks cozy. Oh yeah. Va 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 boom. That's what it, that's that's what they say. Chica, 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 come here, come here. Is that a bed? Oh, it's lumpy. <laughs> good girl. Who's a good girl? Oh. oh. Yeah. How hot is it? Try it for yourself. Oh, it's not that hot. Ooh. Oh, that's <laughs> awesome. That's really cool. Is your hand frozen solid? Yeah. <laughs> Get oh, that glob off. Oh, oh glob. Oh, you went too far. No, I can go further. <laughs> this is what it is to go <laughs> even further beyond. Plus ultra. <laughs> oh, it's warm. It's, it's hot so wax. warm. For the people at home watching, this is incredibly painful. Much like neti pots, this is what it what after moms come home from work or whatever they're doing. They rush and oh, they get no. their neti pot in their nose and they start heating up their wax. Do you think the neti pot their wax through their nose? <laughs> Only the most daring. <laughs> Jacksepticeye now comes in a matte white finish. <gasps> we should make our own YouTuber wax museum. Yes. But they're alive underneath the wax. Yes. Wow. I don't know if that's a good idea or a great idea. Oh, little nip fingers. I'm so thick. Mm, you were pretty thick. I'm before. so thick. It's like my hand's a glazed donut. Ethan, get on the table. What? I'm gonna wax your chest. What? I'm gonna paint it on you. Okay, you're going to paint it on me. You are not going to pour it on me. Why would I pour it on you? Because I don't trust are you. Are you insane? These <laughs> hands. Look at these hands. <laughs> I can't pour. <laughs> All right, I'll do it. I wonder if we hair dry like this beforehand to soften it up a little bit. It feels so cool to take off. And then we can just put it right back in. Yeah. yeah. Right? Yeah. Should I? Gross. Gross. But yeah. Oh, now we're going to get a peanut allergy. Oh. <laughs> Too late now, boys. Damn it. This is a great toy. Yeah, this is awesome. Why it for your kids? Cover them in wax. I'm just warming it up, man. What's the ignition point of your crotch? <sighs> Hotter than you can handle. Hotter than the sun. Yeah. It'll soften it up nice. <laughs> what? Did you, okay, yeah, what's up? Did uh, you dump ass? Look, man. <laughs> Is that a package of paraffin wax in your pants, or are you just happy to see me? Whoa. <laughs> All right, Ethan, get on the table. Okay, hold on. I'm just going to take this off. Ethan, get on the table. Okay. Right now. Jeez, guys. Right here. here. Look, right where we're pointing. Here. Okay. There's something like Terminator about it, like dun dun, dun 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 dun. No! Dun dun. <laughs> I feel insecure about my body. <laughs> oh fuck. Yeah. There she goes. I can't pick it up. <laughs> Not with these hands. Put the brush in. Put the brush in. <laughs> yes. Can I put this pillow down just for comfort? Yeah, man. Cool. Can I have a liner on there? What if the wax gets on it? Oh, my God. Just put the pillow down and get on the table. There. I'm a man. <laughs> okay, Go Just lay like down. Oh, oh, my God. It's you, hot. It's, you put your hand in it. Oh, What's wrong with you? It's cold. <laughs> it's Move fine. your arms. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Move. Stop reaching for Wait, it. Wait, hold on. Don't what? go so fast. It's hard. It's not that bad. Is it burning you? Wait, wait. I have an idea. Let's <laughs> fill his belly button with wax. <laughs> oh my god, get your hands away. What is wrong with you? It's, it's just an inch of wax. <laughs> it tickles so much. Oh, just deal with it. Oh my god. I feel uncomfortable doing this now. I'm making a reservoir. 
floor of wax in your belly button. Just close your eyes. He's gonna pull it out. It's gonna be a mold of your intestines. Give him some meditation. Give him some. Give him some soothing sounds. Um. <laughs> I just want you to look like an action man. All right. You want me to suck your nose? <laughs> oh, it's in my armpit and it burns. <laughs> what did you say? It's in my armpit and it burns. It doesn't can't burn. burn. It's safe. Safe. Dude, moms do this. So safe. Oh, my God. Kiss the head. Or wait. <laughs> Think about it this way: the more wax that's on you, the less you'll feel it, and the <laughs> wax his mouth shut. Oh, good idea! No. Oh, what if we molded your face into a different face? Oh, what if I did my face in there? Don't do that. <laughs> you don't tell him what to do. Okay. Am I going to finish off my chest? No. You wouldn't let us. Okay. All right, hang on. That melted? I don't think it did anything. <laughs> it just smells now. Mm, yeah, it's not so good. You. Yeah. Help him take shirt take off. Take my shirt off. I'm not, not going to. I like that Mark and Ethan have both ended up shirtless again. Sean, you have to do it too. I, I... Oh, this view is awful. <laughs> <laughs> Put a shirt on. What's wrong with you? Mark, a little mouthy time? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. Oh, is this is this is some, like, horror movie not letting you scream. <laughs> is it, is it <laughs> Don't laugh. Mm -hmm. Shh. Shh. <laughs> His mouth needs more. Ethan, combine with me on this. Okay. His mouth needs much more. Oh, I love that it's dripping down your face, too. Don't look over it. Put a symbol there. I'm part of the wax cores now. I want to go on your nose really bad, but I don't want it to drip into your eyes. Do it. <laughs> We're next, Mark. Mm -hmm. Me? Mm -hmm. oh, oh, get a look at that. Oh, yeah. Like a newborn baby. This is my snake skin. <laughs> you look like someone just spat in your face. <laughs> I, hold on, I'm undressing. <laughs> Yeah, this is me every day. <laughs> I'm hairier than both of you. This is what a real man looks like. Oh, looks it's like. time to get your belly. Yes. It's time to fill your belly button. This is going to be so nice. My pores are going to open. Ethan, what were you complaining about? This is awesome. It was a little hotter, okay? No, it wasn't. It's hotter than it's ever been because it's all melted now. <laughs> Am I just in... Entirely covered in wax? Mm -hmm. You're about to be. Are you guys trying to make a toy Jack mm -hmm. Betcha. Are you trying to make a baby brother? Mm -hmm. What? Mm -hmm. Speak up, wax man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Back in the sun. Oh, Mark, you just all over yourself. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, you look so scary. <laughs> okay. This is nice. You're spreading it now. I kind of want it elsewhere. Mm. Where's it elsewhere? I'll leave that up to your imagination. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Warmer? Mm -hmm. Wax hot. How how much do you think it would hurt to dip your balls in the wax? Probably not that much. Mark, will you dip your balls in the wax? Yes. <laughs> I will do it. I will be the ball dipper. I will be the bearer of the balls. Will you actually? Oh my god, what did you do to me? It's huh. gonna be dope to it's take gonna, off. It's gonna be dope. It's gonna be dope. No, wait, it's gonna be dope. Over oh, and over oh. again. Ew. It's like turned brown. Are you taking it off? Yeah. I'm taking it oh. off. I'm like wallpaper. It's like a sunburn. Oh, the hair ruins the, the procedure though. Maybe my body's too hot. I'm surprised it didn't just melt right off me, right? Yeah. What? Yeah. Oh no, my belly button! <laughs> Ew! I'm revolted by my body. Okay, highest bidder. Who wants it? It's my snake skin. <laughs> it's my belly skin. Oh god. He is lost to the wax. Oh god. Oh no. Beautiful? Yeah. Did it work? It, it kinda did. Other oh, shit. No. No. Okay, it doesn't stop. <laughs> Oh Did no! You not drink it. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm pulling it out of my belly. Oh yeah. No, that's 
That's some good stuff. That, that's what I wanted. I'm taking this home. Oh, there's one single <laughs> air in it. Oh. Paraffin wax. You know, be responsible. Don't be don't be dumb. Like we and, were? Uh, yeah, you know, it's relatively safe, but, but you know, be a little safer, because this isn't a super great idea to do with specifically your face. <laughs> that was up my nose. I'm not putting that back in. Stop, don't look at me like that. Look over there. <laughs> no! <laughs> uh, listen, guys. We're all gonna die. Okay. It's okay. Henry, you want a treat? Sit. Not on the edge, you're gonna fall. Henry, you're on the edge. Henry, you can cope, 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 get cope. Henry, Henry, just. Oh my God, boy. you're so good. You're a good boy. Henry, come here. Good boy. Oh, good job. You're a good boy. All right, I've got you hooked up to three engines. Think of episode one of the Phantom Menace. You know the pod racers? They only had two. Yeah. This is three. I don't know how fast you're gonna go. Yeah. You might hit light speed. Just remember, if you do, take pictures, because we don't know what that's like. Uh, every athlete has a moment in their lives that they've been training for. This, this is my moment. This is your moment. This is my moment to shine. This, this is what is I've been moment. working for. This, this is what I spent my college fund on. This, this is my dream. In five seconds, my dream will be a reality. Five, four, three, two, one. Come here, come here. Come here. No, it's you must. the wrong way. This way. Okay. It's working. Okay. Okay, this way. It's working. Way. At the speed. <laughs> <laughs> I can hardly handle the G's, Mark. I might pass out, but I must press on. This is counterproductive. I don't think we did. I don't think they're up to enough. I don't think they've trained enough. Yeah, I don't think I've trained these dogs a day in their life. I thought we had something here. Yeah. What if it's not transporting humans? But transporting each other. And you pop and a little more and then right there. Okay, good. Good girl. Can you sit? Sit, girl. Sit. Sit. So slow, but so careful. Perfect. You are Santa now. Where we failed, you will succeed. Just like we put on all of our future generations, our hopes and our dreams and everything that we didn't accomplish, you will. You'll pick up where I left off. That's your destiny, to follow in my footsteps and exceed them. And if you don't, I will be disappointed. I just gotta figure out how to get Spencer and Henry to pull you. We can make it work. Three, two, one, Henry! I think we've had this backwards the entire time. Right. I think that we should be the ones that are pulling them. Right. You know? Yeah. And with the strengths of both of us, I think we can make it happen. We're going to go all or nothing with this, okay? Okay. We just pull. We pull. And we pray. And we pray. That she is still there. Okay. And she will be. Yeah. If we believe it, it will be so. You will things into existence. That's right. Okay. Ready? Three, two, two one. one. Go. Oh, we're doing it. It's working. It's working, Mark. Don't fall off, Tina. I can't push She's fine, Mark. She's fine. We've created something incredible here. She's swimming, Mark. We did it. Chica? This way. She's gone now. She's ascended to another plane. She doesn't need us anymore. We were so concerned about pushing her out of the nest, we didn't know what we'd do when she was gone. On her own. Yeah. You know, but we did the best that we could with what we had. And I think she'd be proud of us for that. It's like she's still here. You can still feel her. Yeah. Dawn. Never forgotten. Never. Well, let this be a lesson to all of you. Don't fly too close to us. Cause hot. Oh, Chica. Oh, hey. Hey, how you doing? Hey. 
Uh, I'm gonna need next month's rent. Of course, it's just a multivitamin, CoQ10, and fish oil. If anything, it's probably <laughs> good for you to take these. You got any loafers? Well, time for me to take my medicine. All right, Grampy. Thursday, Friday, Saturday, it's, Sunday, it's Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Looks like he didn't take Sunday through Wednesday. You might want to take those, too. Give me my... Man, these... <laughs> Goose ceremonies. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Give me my gamo del toro right now. Uh, Alright. Paps, here. Hit me up. Mm. <clears throat> you get it down, Grampy? Oh, uh, one now. <laughs> one? Two to go. I thought you were just going to slug them all. You think my throat's big enough for that? I can do it. Mm. Even in my old age, I'd be able to slug those down. They don't make those ceremony like they used to. So, do you feel like an old man? <sighs> oh, boy. Do you feel the weight of your years tearing at your soul? I do. Pulling you down. down. Gravity weighing down. deeper and deeper mm -hmm. until you're eventually drawn into the grave. All right, do a lap. So, let's see how fast you can get around the around the pool. Okay, that's the starting the line. So you have to you have to cross yeah, off the ledge and across this brick. Okay? Three, two, one, go. Jesus Christ. Who made this walkway? They'll probably be fine. Okay, up we go. Uh, hey, at least you didn't go in, right, Gramp? That's right. At least I didn't go. Okay. How's she doing? A little water, lad? Ah, it's fine. She's got a little, uh, you got some water in case you ever get thirsty. That's right. That's Let's right. put your pills back in there. Ooh, warm. Yeah, warm, right. right? A little leaky, just like me. <laughs> I'll hold for the helicopter, Grandpa. There's a helicopter. Grandpa. It's a hella chubby. And there she goes. And get your body through there and almost there and time. <sighs> Four minutes, 38 seconds, blazing speed. All right. Your turn. <laughs> what wisdom. Such, such insight. Every second that goes by, I get younger and younger. I can feel my 60s, my 50s, my 40s, my 30s, my youth. Ah, it's back. All right, Grandpa. Ah, uh, boy. It's all right, Grandpa. You've had, a, you've had a rough go of it. Uh, is this wet? It's a little bit wet. Why is it wet? It's a little wet. It went in the pool. Why? Well, Grandpa Nestor... Who are you playing? Fell in the pool. With those friends. I don't have any friends, Grandpa. You That's... gotta take your pills. I hate the pills. Today's Wednesday. There's no pills in Wednesday. Well, then that means you didn't take any on your Tuesday. They're damp. Yeah? Well, they're about to be even more damp. Uh, you take the glucerna. Uh, Good. Do you like the glucerna? That's fine. All right, are you ready? Well, for what? 
For the time of your life, Grandpa. What? The time of your life. Why? You're, we're gonna have a little race against the clock. Back, the line's back here. Where? Back, back it up. Beep, beep. I can't. Ready? Yeah. We're gonna go all the way around the pool. Where? All the way to the left or the right. We're gonna go all the way around the edge of the pool and back across that brick. Bright. Bright. It's very <sighs> bright. All right, you ready? For oh, what? Time you. You're gonna go all the way across, all right? <sighs> all right, ready? Three. What do I get if I win? You get the gift of knowing that you were the best. <sighs> you like that, don't I, you? I you like, like that. Three, two, <sighs> one, go. <sighs> Oh, he's off to a big, great start. Power through, Grandpa. Power through. Did I do it? No, you have to go all the way around the pool. All Where? the way. All the way around the pool. Where? All the way around the pool. Where? All the way around the pool. What pool? This pool. All the way around it. Where? Oh, you're making great time. Are you having the time of your life? Yes! I crushed my enemies. I can crush you. You have to go up it. You have I to only put, go through. You have to put your wheels on top. You no can't, obstacle is beating me. You can't go through it. It's concrete. You have to go over it. Do you need help? I'm fine. Do you need help? I'm fine. I can call Nurse Tracy. No. I'm fine. You're getting a little close to the edge. Just I'm be careful. Fine. It's not great for your back. Do you want help? Now remember, hang a little bit of a right here so you don't go in the hot tub. A little bit of a right. You're going left. Go to the right. Go to the right. That was to the left. Grandpa, your walker fell in there. I can get Tracy to help you out. You shouldn't go in the pool. Remember what happens when you get wet? You get real weighed down, and it takes a long time for you to dry off. Why? Your skin's not as tight as it used to be, you know? Water doesn't slick off of it like it used to. It takes six, seven hours for you to dry off sometimes, and I don't have time to deal with that. Uh, no. I can get Nurse Tracy no. to grab it for you. No. I bought you a baseball. You're the transitive pump. Do you even understand that? You wouldn't. Grandpa, I don't think that you should get in the... Grandpa, do you need help? Grandpa, can you hear me? Do you need help? Grandpa? Just walk to the edge. Walk to the edge. My walker. Remember, you don't have to go... Grandpa, Grandpa, Grandpa. Tracy, he fell in the pool again. Do you want me to just get him out of the pool, or do you want to come over and get him out of the pool? I'm, I'm thinking that we should just put him in a home soon. Because it's... You know, it's tough dealing with him. You know? Like, I love him to death. But, like, it's just really hard seeing him like this. He's just getting to a state of... He's so delusional. He doesn't know where he is half the time. You know, having you come over here every couple of days is, is great. Like, you've been a huge help, but I think round-the-clock care is really what we need. Is the year half full? Or is the year half empty? Either way. You're running out of time. Six months, 183 videos. 2,693. Minutes of Unis Honest. So many memories already made. I feel like I'm choking. Only so many memories left for us to make. Already halfway to the end. Have you been enjoying yourselves? Have you been making the most of every day you've been given? Or have you convinced yourself that the end... A year seems like such a long time. But if you're not paying attention, days can seem like seconds. farther and farther away. If you don't pay attention now, you might never get another chance. So as we celebrate another six months of 
last fun moment. In a few minutes, we are going to send him off into the sea where I will shoot and fire one flaming bullet onto the coffin. So, we reveal the boy one last time. Did you give your eulogy? Not yet. Oh, okay. Just make it nice. Mark was a humble... Uh, humble? I don't think we'd call him humble. Mark, he was a man. A strong man, strong-willed and strong-bodied. What he lacked in intelligence, he made up for with his charm, his smile, and his okay penis. Few have experienced what Mark truly who he was. He was a man who did things, and he did them until he wasn't doing them anymore. He was a great friend. He was a noble person. He was kind. He's kind of attractive. He's kind of attractive. In some circles, he'd be attractive. All right. With that, that was awful. I'm going to. I don't think he made a complete sentence the entire time. The flame. Oh, jeez. Send him into the water. This thing, oh, this thing can flow, right? Yeah. The ceremonial. Yeah. Well, I'm not in the water. Don't worry about it. Oh, <laughs> I did the wrong one. Hold on. Ow. All right. Here he goes. <gasps> Out into the water. <gasps> where we remember Mark Edward Fishbach. He's floating out to sea. We don't need to we don't need to watch him anymore. He's floating out to sea. We'll do one last call of the horns to him. Thank you. For your service to us as a content creator, fly away into the great beyond. Thank you all so much for coming to Mark's Viking funeral. There's nothing that we can say more to commemorate this man's life. But maybe back up here in the comments, you can say some words for him. I will be carrying on the channel by myself. 
for we have lost the other half. The honest to my unis. Mark Fishbach. each other. So don't watch this video once it comes out, okay? Okay. It all started with a what if. What if we made a self-destructing channel? What if after one year, we set everything to rest? This is where Unis Honest was born. Born from the idea that everything is temporary. Born from the belief that you should never take time for granted and you should live every day like there's no tomorrow. We took each day on as a new adventure, an opportunity to learn, an opportunity to grow, an opportunity to step out of our comfort zones. Whether it was being pepper sprayed, making breakfast with the unlikeliest of tools, or painting each other naked, we took every chance we got to experience something to its fullest. This is what defined Unis Hanas. To Mark, thank you for being an inspiration to me to Amy and to so many others. Thank you for having me a part of this amazing adventure, for having me as your partner in crime, your accomplice in idiocy, and just simply as your friend. To the fans, thank you for not only joining in on this journey with us, but for supporting and pushing us every step of the way. And finally, to me, Ethan, thank you for not giving up. Thank you for continuing to push yourself further, to get yourself out of your comfort zone. Thank you for taking a leap of faith. No matter what we do, time ticks on. We must do everything we can for their small piece of it. Memento Mori. Unis. Honest. 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 Dearest Mark. 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 By the time you read this, you will have accomplished so much. You are incredible. You are incredible. You are incredible. I am in awe of your dedication and willpower. Like a fine wine, which you don't drink, you grow better every day. You are stronger than I could ever hope to become because you are the future me. You are the future me. You are the future me. The only human on this earth that is better and more handsome than myself. Thank I also I envy you. For in the far future you will be able to carry on your journey unburdened by those less worthy of your time. Long gone. 2020. Bless you. <laughs> 2019. Long gone. 2020. Here to stay. 2020 will be our final year. No more Unis Honest after this one. That's right. It's time to make sure that we get all of our wishes and wants out of the way because time is already running out. And to kickstart our new year, we thought, what better way than to shock our body into excitement for the new year? <laughs> the Polar Plunge is a tradition to ring in the new year by sensing... The Polar Plunge is a tradition known around the world. You jump in an icy river or an icy body of water or in this pool here, which is at a whopping this temperature... What do we got? At first, we planned on going to the Great Western Sea. <laughs> At first, we planned on going to our wonderful Pacific Ocean here on the coast of California. But today, there just so happens to be an advisory because pollutants are in the water, and also there are too many people celebrating the 1st of July. <laughs> <laughs> and it takes a long time to get to the ocean because LA traffic is terrible. So we thought there's a pool and it's already cold, so why go to the beach? So just
just like everything we do, we challenge you to take the polar plunge as well. But be cautious. It's cold. The water's cold. If you have a heart condition, if you are scared, don't do it. But if you're brave, get a camera ready, find a friend, film it, and put it under the hashtag coldest on us. That's C-O-L-D-U-S-A-N-N-U-S on YouTube. And we will find you, and we will give you something. You will win this. Uh, probably merch or something. I don't know. We never decided on what it was, but we'll send you something, and boy, oh boy, will it be good. Wow. Doesn't that sound great? Well, without further ado, I say we take our plunge into this final year. I agree. I think we should just do a <laughs> let's, let's practice right on this ledge. Okay. So, unis. Honest. Uh, is that how we're doing it, or are we doing it together? <laughs> I think you should be more like, Unis Honest. Like, he's like Cannonball. Unis Honest. <laughs> unis Honest. Perfect. <laughs> Ready? Ready. Unis Honest. Inside of the building. 